Outsider art is a difficult thing to explain. We generally define it as art by people who aren't formally trained, who are operating outside of academic institutions or traditional boundaries of the art world. William Edmondson is one of what we call the old master outsiders. Once he retired, he was given a calling to start carving stone. This fox is in an incredible state of preservation. This limestone hasn't been worn away. You still see his smile, his nostrils, his eye. Bill Trailer was born enslaved and he lived on a plantation in Alabama until his old age when he moved to Montgomery. Trailer had an ability to take repurposed card and very simple artist materials and create an entire universe. Minnie Evans was a gatekeeper at Airly Gardens in 1935. She received divine calling to start creating spiritual art. From that point forward, she managed to combine the spiritual art with imagery and graphics of the lush landscape that she saw every day in her role at this garden art makers who are coming at things from an entirely different perspective. They talk about their lives, their experiences, their religion, all of these elements that really give us art history from the bottom up rather than the top down. Showing outsider art at a place like Christie's is allowing us to fill in the gaps of a much larger narrative of what art history and what art is.